Hello and welcome. Today we'll be talking about the EDCM Slim 2.0 from VanQuest. This has a thousand denier Cordura fabric sprayed with Teflon waterproof and water resistancy coating. It features a grab handle at the top, hook and loop field on the front, three pockets, one on the outside which has a Velcro, YKK zippers, Molly and Pals webbing in the rear, and inverted zipper design. On the inside we have a six inch removable key holder and three positions which you can mount it to. We also have 210D high-vis orange ripstop nylon and we also have 23 elastic webbing slots and two deep vertical pockets on either side of the pouch. Here we have the front of the bag with the easy access pocket with the velcro securing tab here and inside the front pocket I keep a small little Alchi Boo Boo medical kit and that's about it. We have the hook and loop field in the front here. Then on the side, of we, we have the spine here with the double stitching here. Again, fantastic stitching. We have the YKK zippers and the locking tabs that come with the zippers here and the uh, paracord pulls. And on this side, we can see the inverted zipper, which is great at keeping water and dirt out. And then we have the grab handle at the top here. Flipping over to the back, we have the three rows of Molly and Pals webbing. Two tabs down here that are sewn and the two tabs that are sewn up here for the grab handle and that's pretty much the outside of the slim let's open it up and show you an example of what you could pin inside this is a work in progress and not my final uh, packing of the product I plan on keeping this somewhat empty but let's go over some of the items inside we can see the webbing and the 23 channels offset each webbing here we can see the 210d high-vis nylon backing here very very good and it's rip stop which is good we have the six inch removable keychain holder and the mounting points in here one two and three and we have the two deep pockets in the back here so one here with my handkerchief in it and it goes all the way down to the bottom here and this side here with some ivx cleaner and i do have some deep wipes because i work outdoors so i have that in there as an, as an example of how you can pack that and the bottom row here of the webbing, we have a small compass in the bag, which kind of keeps it secure in the webbing here. We have some water purification tablets. We have some hair bands, which I use as rubber bands. And then in this bigger channel, uh, underneath the small main channel on the center part here, this is why I like the VanQuest design team's ideas. It works very well. We have a stormproof match set with some birthday candles. And it fits pretty nicely in the webbing here just about fits perfectly underneath there and again once again you can stack stuff in the front here and you see do you see how this kind of ends up being in the middle here where there's like a, a dip they put a webbing right there so it's offset so that it makes a lot of sense to me in terms of organization and it maximizes your amount of use of space in the in the back here here i have my zippo lighter armor with a thunderbird insert butane insert so I don't run out of uh, fuel. This is my EDC lighter. And on this side, we have the Noctagon KR4 with the dual channel. We have the Olight i5 UV. We have a Swiss Army Mini Champ 2. So that's a fun little cutting tool there and multi-tool. And then we have the Open O2 in copper. And then we also have the Olight i i Olight i1R2 EOS or the, uh, I think this is the 10 or 15. Uh, it's one of the newer lights anyway so it's a pill light basically fits in that channel pretty good and that's pretty much the bag in a nutshell it doesn't have any center mounting points on the, on the center spine here like the other two bags in the uh, category for the ED edcm but it works pretty well and efficiently so let's go ahead and close this up and show you the comparison to the other bags that i have once again i want to thank taylor for sending this out for review uh, so we'll put this back here and we'll get the other two bags on the table. Okay, so we have the EDCM Huge 2.0. And you can see it's a pretty thick bag. This is my electronics bag. This is a recently finished project of mine. This is a, another EDC bag that I made. This is the EDCM Huge. Husky 2.0 and we got the slim. Let's turn them on the side so you can see a thickness comparison. Don't mind the extra crap on the back here. It's just the extra stuff I added with the bag. 
So we can see this is the thickest out of all of them. This is the second thickest in the lineup, and this is the most slimmest, hence the name Slim. So it's pretty straightforward. And that's the comparison for these bags here on the outside. Overall, some final thoughts on the bag. I think it's a great, high-quality product. Uh, we can see the double stitching on here, so the stitching is well done. It offers a lot of options in terms of organizing your gear on the inside, and it relatively stays slim, even with some bigger items packed into the bag here. Perfect for pinning in your big bellow pocket when you're working or just keeping it as a side pouch or something in your bag to organize for the day. My use for this is going to be a changing type of EDC bag, meaning I'm going to keep it empty and whatever items I come throughout the day, I'm going to swap in and out of the bag here. So that's why I have some empty channels here and it's not fully packed like my other bags. Overall, I recommend it to anybody who's looking for a high quality organizational pouch. VanQuest has been making these pouches for years. I've been using their products for years and I use them at work and I will always recommend them to anybody who's looking for some more quality type of bags out there. And that's all I have to say about the EDCM Slim 2.0 from VanQuest. Thanks for watching guys and enjoy your day.